Hey, what's up you guys? It's Bjorn from Triassic Park Triops again. Um, so I recovered uh, since last time and uh, I actually wanted to do a little update video for you guys. Um, what I wanted to talk about is um, the Triops have actually uh, grown quite a bit. They are adult now and uh, they reach quite some awesome sizes already. Look at them. And I do see quite a lot of eggs already as well. Here you can see a bunch of eggs. Connected to the little white snowball type of gravel that I found. <laughs> it really is a different type of substrate. It looks kind of strange but it, uh, it does look pretty nice though. Oh, here is another large pocket of eggs as well. Whoa. <laughs> that's awesome so yeah they have been laying eggs and um, they are doing quite well I must say um, I wanted to take a look at the differences between the granarius male and female as well um, here you can see a couple in one shot the front one is a male and the back one in the back is a, is a lady um, and also you actually can see them attacking each other a little bit it is actually not attacking it is a um, attempt to, do, to mate so they are trying to mate with each other basically constantly the males are currently like currently really active but this is basically what they do all day long they just crawl around they kind of fight a little bit with other males but um eventually they try to find themselves a nice lady to mate with so um these are uh the males they have a way more flat flattened uh, head shield their appearance is just a little bit different than the ladies also they don't have the egg sacs as you can see they lack the egg sacs on the sides it's really hard to zoom in when they are that fast and they are a little bit longer than the female as well. Let's take a look at the female. There is a female digging over here. Over here there is a female digging. Um, and she clearly does have the egg sags. I currently don't see another female around. Oh, and the ratio between males and females ended up um, five females and six males. So that's unfortunately one male too much, but I would have liked if the ratio was all the way around, like six females and five males, but uh, I'm currently working with um, this group now. So, um, yeah, I'm quite interested in how long this colony will live. Uh, I'm keeping them at, let's see, 25 degrees Celsius currently, a little bit on the higher temperature, or I would say mid-range temperature. Some people push their temperatures up to 29 degrees. Uh, I think that's a little bit too high. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, I think they definitely look great. This is the Suchting uh, Mini Oxidator, by the way. It's a uh, little ceramic glass device with uh, H2O. O2 in it I think and uh, it releases pure oxygen into the water um, and yeah for the rest it should help like uh, the climate that's inside the tank I think it works the trials are pretty happy and healthy so um, that's great I'm gonna give them a little bit uh, of some snacks I got some vibra bites and uh, that's what I'm going to feed them right now give me a second guys so I dumped in some uh, Hikara, Hikari Vibra Bites, these are um, food sticks for fish, tropical fish, and they should enhance the colors of fish. So I was wondering if it would enhance the colors of the traps as well, obviously. But um, on the other side, they really like these little sticks and they can grab onto them pretty easily. They even fit between their little leggies and they can actually consume it quite easily as well. So it's a nice snack for triops. They'll be here very soon. Usually when I dunk in these little snacks, they will be there quite fast. It's 
really pretty males as well. Interesting, they look so cool, though, by the way. I really like the Trials Granarias for sure, definitely. Interesting species, I must say. This is a little female. She's a little bit smaller, but she does have the egg sacs again. You can see these these white little linings. These are the egg sacs. <laughs> just a little bit of looking guys I just wanted to take a look with, at what they are doing currently <laughs> crazy little fellas you can see some size differences in them um, but that's basically what happened from the start on like from the starter um, because I had some differences in the hatching dates like some hatched like really fast and some hatched a little bit later as well that's a female oh, she's swimming currently interesting oh she got a snack and she lost the snack as well <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Little goofballs. Oh, that was a mating attempt again. <laughs> and it failed, <laughs> obviously. Oh, and I got a really small specimen in the group as well. This was a really late hatcher. It's a she, and she's pretty small as well. Oh, there is a larger lady as well. In the back. <laughs> so just a little quick update guys that's it for now um i really need got to go and um but i'll be doing another update very soon i promise be right back see you next time guys